A substance found by archaeologists working in an ancient Egyptian tomb has proved to be one of the oldest cheeses ever discovered. Several years ago, the team discovered broken jars in the tomb of Toms, a high-ranking Egyptian official. The archaeologists found a solidified whitish mass in one of the jars which they suspected was food but were unsure which kind. Now a study has identified it as cheese, dating from 3,200 years ago. The discovery is significant as there has been no previous evidence of ancient Egyptian cheese production, authors of the report, published in the journal Analytical Chemistry, said. The material analyzed is probably the most ancient archaeological solid residue of cheese ever found to date, said Dr. Enrico Greco from the University of Catania, who worked with colleagues at the Cairo University in Egypt to determine its identity. We know it was made mostly from sheep's and goat's milk, but for me, it's really hard to imagine a specific flavor. The ancient cheese would have had a really really acidy bite, cheese historian and chemistry professor Paul Kinstedt told the New York Times. The researchers say they also found traces of a bacterium that can cause an infectious disease known as brucellosis, which comes from consuming unpasteurized dairy products. Symptoms include fever, sweating, and muscle aches, and the disease still exists today. IF confirmed it would be the oldest evidence of such a case. The tomb where the cheese was found belonged to Tums, an Egyptian official who was mayor of the ancient city of Memphis 